Welcome to MasterSpec's on-demand training. Today, we'll be taking you through MDocs. MDocs is designed to manage, access, and control the documentation you need to add to your specification. MDocs provides you with instant access to support documentation for commonly used work sections. A version of the latest document is uploaded to the system by the manufacturer or the supplier. This is available to review and with one click, you can attach it to your specification. Let's start by setting your branded work section to complete. You will notice MDocs appears to the right with a flyout. You will now have the opportunity to browse through the documentation the manufacturer has supplied to you. These documents relate to performance, maintenance, installation, warranty, and environmental topics. You can filter through the documentation at the top via the search panel, filter by source, whether it be my products, the manufacturer, or your organization's MDocs library. The final filter allows you to filter by category. View the documents by selecting the title. This will expand your view. You can preview further by selecting the document icon. Once you are ready to attach the document, simply select Attach. If the document is helpful, Give it a like so other designers in the community know it's of value. You can help out your fellow specifiers by letting them know that it is a great resource. If you are unable to find the document you are looking for, simply contact the supplier by selecting Request a Document or visiting their website by selecting the logo at the bottom of the screen. To upload your own documentation, select the Upload button at the top of the MDocs panel. First, choose your file. If the document is reusable for future projects, select My Organization. This will save the document to your practice library for future projects to use across your practice. From then on, the document will appear in MDocs against this work section. If the document is project specific, choose One Off Use. Next, select the purpose of the document, then add a title and description. This is a title that will appear in the appendix table of the contents once you export the specification, so you'll want to make sure it describes the document accurately. Select Upload to load the file. Once you have finished uploading your documentation, simply select Finish. If you would like to review your MDocs appendix before exporting your specification, locate the MDocs appendix tab in the overview screen. Here you will see a list of all downloaded work sections and the documents attached. To export your MDocs appendix, select the Export tab. Choose a file format, select the manufacturer slider, enter in all other required fields, and select Export Now. Note here that you can uncheck unrelated categories if you require specific documents. For example, you may only want to export the insulation and maintenance information for the builder or performance and environmental for the council. Once your document is exported, you will notice a manufactured document, table of contents index, highlighting the branded work sections and how many documents are related to it. These branded work sections are hyperlinked to the pertaining title page. Below you will notice each branded work section has its own specific title page. This includes the manufacturer contact details, supporting documents with reference numbers, the date the document was uploaded into MDocs, and the document's purpose. 